old red and blue. Not too shabby. I take it our deal is off? There's not enough money in the world for me to turn a blind eye to your great works. Keep the light on. Because I'm coming for you! It appears you have a job opening. We'll take it. should start locking those windows. So, do we have a deal? If you really want a job, you'll have to prove yourself. Pass one simple test. Destroy Spider-Man. <laughs> we were hoping you'd say that. Oh, you don't mind if we have a little fun with him first. I don't micromanage. She looks a lot better, considering she just had a heart attack. Still, I hate seeing her hooked up to all these machines. She must have been so scared, and I wasn't here for her. Uncle Ben said that with great power comes great responsibility. But shouldn't my first responsibility be to the people who rely on Peter Parker? Flash, gave me a pretty hard time the other day. Just the other day? I must be slipping. Thanks for the reality check. Don't mention it. And I mean not to anyone. Hey, Petey. How's your aunt? Better, thanks. Um, and guys, I, look, I'm so sorry about how I acted. School? You must be under a ton of stress. Yeah, you could probably use an angst break. And we could use some help holding the big Mustang balloon at the Thanksgiving Day Parade tomorrow. I can't. I'm sorry. You know, if, if the doc gives me the okay, I'll be bringing Aunt May home. That's okay. Oh, are you going back today? Because I'll go with you to, to, to the hospital after school, if you want. Well, thanks. I'm sure Aunt May would love to see you. Well, okay. I, I, I better get to class. Pete, um, I know you've got a lot on your mind, but... I went on a date with Eddie. A, a, a date? But... He only asked me out because he thought you and I were a thing. He wanted to hurt you, and he didn't mind using me to do it. Well, it, it has been pretty rough between us, but... No, no. He's, he's still my bro. Be careful, Tiger. I don't think he's your bro anymore. It's Eddie. Message me. Uh, hey, Eddie, it's Pete. Look, uh, about your job, man, I'm... I really am sorry. Hey! Was just changing. Appreciate the call. So, how about we hook up after class? A, a rain check? Like, I, I really need to be with Aunt May. Sure, we'll see each other soon enough. Spider-Man. Everything okay? A-okay. So unless your aunt's developed an affinity for hospital food, she can go home tomorrow to enjoy Thanksgiving. That's wonderful, Dr. Bromwell. Now I can fix my usual turkey dinner. I got it covered, Aunt May. <laughs> I'll prepare the feast. 
How hard can it be? Ramita's delivers turkey and fixin's pizza. Oh, late as usual. Ah, but web slinging should get me to Aunt May on time. Ow. The gene cleanser. Almost forgot I hit it here. This antidote solved Doc Connor's little lizard problem. I bet it could solve my spider problem, too. I mean, I mean, sure, Spidey saved a lot of lives. But is that why I do it? Or am I in it for the thrill? The escape? <laughs> Oh, you don't need to wear a mask with us, Pete. We know all your secrets. Because, of course, we were you. The symbiote. I destroyed Did you really think a little refrigeration would do us in? You ensnared another human being? Someone better suited to our gifts. And to our mission. Destroying you for rejecting us. From, From now on, on, we're poison to Peter Parker, Parker and Spider-Man. We're Venom! Destroying you now would be too easy. You haven't suffered enough, and we want to dismantle you piece by piece. After all, we know who you are and everyone you care about. Sorry. <laughs> Bad idea, startling my favorite heart patient. Oh, flowers, huh? A boyfriend? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I'm sure Peter sent them. Although the card's signed, guess who? Stay away from her! So, how are you getting home? Peter's picking me up. You're not going near her! Fine. She's not our only target. After all, we know who you love the most. Bro. Maybe? You guess. Think, Pete. Besides Aunt May, who would Eddie believe I loved? Mary Jane. Well, if it isn't the big turkey himself. I still can't believe the symbiote got Eddie. Maybe I don't want to believe. He was right there when I tried to destroy it. And MJ warned me. If I listened, she wouldn't be in danger right now. There she is! And with Flash. Ew. Well, at least Flash isn't evil. Okay, well, at least he's not possessed by an evil symbiote. At least not as far as I know. I just gotta keep MJ in sight. My spider sense will warn me if Venom tries any surprise attacks. <laughs> Gotta hand it to you, big boy. You're persistent. But how about you chill long enough for us to wish Gwen luck? 
Never mind. Eddie Brock's with her. someone else. so much quality time together. Venom doesn't register to my spider sense as a threat. Eddie, please, fight it! Don't let the symbiote control you! No one's being controlled. controlled. We, we simply, simply share, share the same, same desire. desire. Your destruction. Liked her. Let me save her. Oh, you'd love that to be her hero. Oh, but you're the villain here. Uncle, we had no one. We've always been alone. Until now. And we're done talking. Ha, Wood Oak's mascot's pretty cool, but the animatronic chick makes him look like King Kong. Not Kenny, the monkey. King Kong was an ape, not a... Gwen! Not a Gwen? That makes no sense. You're missing the black suit now. Oh, will you please just shut up? That's funny. He, he can, can quit, quit it out. But, but he can't take it. Mustang's hero time. Let's move. Flash, they can't leave the balloon. Well, forget the balloon. Gwen's in trouble. QB's called an audible. Break! Rand Robertson, don't you dare! Oh! Come on, Venom. That's the best you've got? I'll stick with the red, torn, and blue. Oh, we, we can shred more than a suit! Now, shouldn't y'all have seen that coming? A slow descent. Clever. But you won't save her that way. Any time. Now get that creep. That's the plan, Eugene. We've toyed with you long enough. Okay. 
You win. <laughs> of, of course, course we, we win. win. Not you. It. The symbiote's proven its point. I'm nothing without it. Take me back. That's what it wants, right? A reunion with its first love? <laughs> the symbiote's found a better partner in me. Me? Not us. Wait! No! You can't do this! Don't... Don't leave me. You tricked us! The emotions all taste wrong! You never wanted us back at all! Wow, you do know me well. Fool, you've let us back in, and we will have you. No, you don't. It's over. Not so tough without a human host, huh? Let's make sure you never find another. Okay, you mooks, enough cork and back to work. Peter, is that you? Uh, yeah, it's it's me. Well, come in, you big silly. I, I swung by the hospital. I mean, I didn't actually swing, but I, I, I took a cab, but you were already gone. Dr. Bromwell gave me a ride and made sure I had everything I needed. Um... You didn't go into the kitchen, did you? Oh, I wouldn't worry about that. Happy Thanksgiving, Peter. Uh, Gwen, are, are you all right? Uh, I, I mean, I heard... She insisted on coming. Gave me the look. I'm fine. <laughs> well, not fine, but alive. Just glad I started the turkey this morning. You know, before the post-traumatic stress kicked in. Uh... Yeah, about the turkey, what's the... Well, didn't your aunt tell you? She thought you might need a little help in the kitchen. <laughs> Maybe just a little. Mmm. 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 It's good. Um, so how are you feeling, Aunt May? If you're tired... I'm fine, Peter, and I wouldn't have missed this for the world. I'm just thankful Spider-Man saved my daughter. We do have a lot to give thanks for. Family, friends, relative good health. Of course, I am a tad disappointed my hospital bill will wipe out the advance from the publishing company. Whoa, what publishing company? Why, the one publishing my cookbook, dear. Of course, I'll have to write a new one now. One that's a little more heart-smart. Do you think I can get an advance on that one, too? I feel so guilty leaving poor Peter to clean up. Stop it! My mess, okay? Speaking of messes, maybe I do let people down. A lot. But hey, I'm always there to save them, too. Spidey's not a disease that needs a cure. And he's more than just a random bug bite, too. Spider-Man is who I am. My destiny. Oh, man. This was amazing, Gwen. You're amazing. Thanks. No prob. Well... Night. <laughs> <laughs>